Hey, it's uh, Keith Elder uh, doing a part two series of the Cape Horn 2013 for sale. Um, I'm over at the lodge. I'm going to show you the trailer, kind of do a little walkthrough of it so you can kind of see uh, it. I don't have any pictures of it, so I wanted to uh, get that up today. Uh, so let me just turn around and just show you this, okay? So here's the trailer. I got it hooked up to the truck so we can go around and check all the lights. There it is. You can see there we got a little tree growing up in it. Uh, that's because the trailer hasn't been used much at all. Uh, the previous owner of the boat lived about 10 minutes from a boat ramp, and so it had very little usage on it. Uh, since I bought it, the boat stays dry racked at the marina, if you look at the other video. And the, the trailer stays here at the lodge where I keep it. The last time the trailer was actually moved was last at the end of last September when we went to Venice. I had all of the hubs reworked. Everything was done on the trailer itself. It is a magic tilt trailer, as you see. Very good shape. We're gonna walk around. I haven't checked the lights. Uh, this, this is just a very dry run that I'm doing. So those lights work. All the tires look good. We're gonna come back and check on the tires here in a second. Just giving you a, kind of a walk around. With all the lights. Okay, everything. All right. I will point out, I think this tire here, this is a new tire that was put on last year because uh, the one that was on it was separating. The tires are clever, K-L-E-V-E-R. I don't know if you can even read that. Uh, the axles on this trailer are 7,500 pound axles. Uh, that's what I was told. So um, it, the boat weighs, I think on the trailer, everything you're talking about, 10,000 pounds. So, so it looks like all of the lights uh, work there. And all of that stuff. So it's in really, really good shape. Uh, it comes with a full spare um, that you can stick on. They both put an axle on there and actually turns. Before somebody comes and gets the boat, I'll uh, pull the trailer out and uh, have everything double checked that all the lights and everything's working good uh, for you. You can see all the, all the rails, all the bunks uh, are all good. Sorry about the tree there. I really haven't used the trailer much. It just sits out here uh, locked up on the lodge property that we're on. So. Kenda, I said clever earlier. Kenda, yeah, Kenda Clever AP. So they're Kenda radials. That's so Kenda is the manufacturer. Clever AP is the actual tire type for it. Okay. I uh, don't know what else you want to see with it. Uh, it's a trailer. It holds a boat. It holds a 31 foot Cape Horn boat. Let's check the uh, front mechanism up here. Let's check the strap uh, from there. It's not dry rotted or anything, it looks pretty good. Looks everything's tight. Uh, this is a nice feature of the trailer. It actually, when you when the, you pull the bow up here, the, the boat will be on the trailer. And then uh, you use this particular to hook to the bow. Uh, it's not really a cleat, it's a whatever that little U-joint is. You hook to that, and what that allows you to do is tighten this down. And that holds the bow of the boat onto the trailer. Uh, here I do have two toe straps for it as well. Um, that's it. So let's, let's check the tires. I brought a quarter with me. So we got a quarter. You see that? So let's check the depth of the tread on the spare. Just lay it up there. There you go. See that? Let's go check the ones on the back and stuff. I did see a little wasp flying around, so I don't know if he has a little home here or what. I'm gonna check before I do anything. All right, I don't see one. All right, so let's take, and let me see the tread there. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. The tires are actually got a lot of tread on them. I mean, again, uh, I'm on the boat over a year and a half, um, and the 
trailer has been to Lake Pickwick up in North Mississippi once. It went to Venice another time. And that's it. Uh, it just sits because the boat's kept in dry storage. But occasionally you want to go to Venice and throw it on a trailer. So you got to have a trailer. So uh, look at these. Solid. All the, all the padding is good, you know. Looking up down the padding here. No tears, no nothing. Uh, so like I said, I'll have it, I'll check all the lights out. If, if I find one that doesn't work, I'll get it fixed before you take ownership of it. The trailer does set here, you know how, you know how things are when they, when they set. Um, but I just had all of the axles and everything done on it last, uh, last year, um, after, uh, about, I guess it was around July when I had it done, had, uh, had all the lights rechecked here recently. Um, yeah, it's just ready to roll, uh, wherever you are. I would throw the boat on it and head to all the way to Michigan if, uh, if I had to. So that's it. That is the Magic Tilt trailer that's fitted for the Cape Horn 31 2013 XS that's for sale. All right, big old chain, two and five sixteenths inch ball. All right, brake. I don't know if we can check the fluid. Can't get it up. Last time I checked it, it was full. Okay, that's it. Big old trailer. I don't know what it weighs, but it, it's heavy. That's it. All right, signing off. Thanks for watching.